SLAM RISKS is a process which uses your experience with the task. The SLAM RISKS process is a brief approach to risk assessment. It is well documented that most accidents happen whenever a slight change in procedures occurs or something out of the ordinary takes place during the work process. This should be a red flag when this occurs to take additional precautions and do a risk assessment. This can prevent accidents. Let's take a look at the steps for conducting a risk assessment. Will you be performing a new task or doing something that might be a non-routine task or possibly even be performing a task in which there have been changes in procedures? Here are some guidelines that you can follow. Step one, stop, not so fast. Take a look around, think through the task. Make considering risks a part of your everyday activities. Step two, look. Identify the hazards for each job step. Step three, analyze. Determine if you have the knowledge, training, and tools to do the task safely, and determine what else you need. Step four, manage. Remove or control the hazards and use proper equipment. Let's take this a step further and remember, always make risk assessment part of your activities. Identify all potential risks and hazards and know how to correct them. Share what you find with others impacted by the task. Know what others on your job site are doing. Safety. Commit to working safely. Make it a habit. Remember, the process is nothing more than taking a quick survey of what in a task might be harmful to you, to those working with you, to those people in the area. It will also help you determine if enough precautions have been taken or if more should be done to prevent harm. As we said earlier, the mining environment is ever-changing. Let's say that you've been performing maintenance. After shutting down welding, cutting torches, putting your tools back into the bucket, unplugging a drill motor and so forth, you come to the end of your shift. The next day when you return, your work area could have changed. Take a few moments to look around and examine the area for any hazards that you either noticed earlier or have been created since you were there last. If you jump right back into the task you were performing, you may find out that the environment has changed and new unexpected hazards have developed. Are you starting a new task? Ask someone who is knowledgeable in the task before starting. Take a few moments to look around and examine the area for any hazards. Discuss with experienced persons your concerns. Ask yourself questions like, can I or someone else come in contact with an energy source or hazardous material? Can I or someone else be struck by anything? Can I or someone else strike against anything? Can I or someone else be caught in, on, or between anything? Can I or someone else slip, trip, or fall? Is there a possibility that I or someone else can sprain, strain, or suffer from overexertion by doing the task? It's as simple as that. Just think about hazards and risks before beginning a task.